Geek, Chef Nikki here, back with another episode of Nikki Talks Food. So before we begin today, I just wanna remind you guys to please hit the subscribe button, smash that, you know, they do the beginning stuff. I'm gonna do the beginning stuff now. Don't forget to hit the little bell, that is the subscribe button, right? Uh, leave a comment down below afterwards. I don't know, how do you do this pre-stuff? Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Subscribe with the bell. Subscribe with the bell. Leave a comment down below. Leave a comment down below. Today we're gonna make three of my favorite drinks. We're gonna make my vacation drink. We're gonna make a s'mores drink with toasted marshmallow and graham cracker. And then the last drink is a peach tea. So let's get started. All right, so our first drink is called the vacation drink. So the number one rule in bartending is ice is your friend. So this is called a mixing tin. You can get its little friend here, a uh, little partner at you know a restaurant supply store, or you can get it maybe on Amazon. But uh, these are a necessity to making good drinks because good drinks need to be shaken because aeration unlocks flavor. So we're gonna make the vacation drink first. We're gonna start with an ounce and a quarter of orange flavored vodka. Next is a half ounce of coconut rum. Then we're gonna add uh, two ounces of cranberry juice and two ounces of pineapple juice. And then we're gonna shake it up. Oh. <laughs> we gotta have a sexy garnish for this drink. Think about drinking and driving. Take a freaking Uber. Next up, our s'mores drink. This one's a cheeky little cocktail. It's kind of creamy, it's got some toasted marshmallow, it's got cookies. It's perfect for sitting by the fire or sitting poolside in the evening time watching the fireflies. Okay, so again, ice is our friend, so we're gonna fill our tin. With about halfway with ice. And then we're gonna put uh, an ounce and a half of whipped vodka. Now there are flavored vodkas out there that um, are appropriate for this drink. This one is a whipped cream flavored vodka. It's made by Pinnacle. Um, they are not sponsoring me, but it's delicious and I am just suggesting it for this drink. So ounce and a half of that whipped vodka. And we're gonna go ahead and fill our little measuring device. And then we're gonna do two ounces of heavy cream. As much chocolate syrup as you want. Shake it real good. Into this cute little mug. That freaking sexy. That's how you smash that out. Little marshmallow spread into a plastic baggie. around the outside. Campfirey. Next up, our peach iced tea. So first we're gonna make this beautiful peach simple syrup. And we're gonna do that by adding a cup of water uh, to a little saucepan and sliced up one whole peach. Uh, we're also gonna add a half a cup of sugar. And we're gonna cook this down just until the sugar melts. So we're basically making what's called a simple syrup or a flavored syrup. Careful, Nikki. So you're gonna want this peach flavored syrup to cool down before you add it to your drink. So while our peach syrup is cooling, we are gonna work on our garnish. So we're gonna do a little grilled peach garnish and what we're gonna do is brush this half a peach with some balsamic vinegar. And that's gonna aid in the caramelization and just give a little zing to our, to our garnish. Dab off any excess. And we're gonna spray our grill pan with cooking spray, and then we're gonna spray our peach. Got our 
sandwiches. Alice and a half of your favorite vodka. Some more if you're feeling fruity. And then a half ounce of our peach syrup. Fill the rest of the way with your favorite iced tea. And then we're gonna shake it up. show don't forget to smash that subscribe button hit the little bell leave a comment down below and as always leave a thumbs up I want to know what you guys want to learn next let's talk about food rain down again huh Pa?